it be funny if I told you that I've recorded this intro four times without recording this? No. All right, today we're shooting the 6.5 Grindle. The only bullet we're shooting is the Hornady 123 grain SSTs, with the exception of the factory loads that we shoot. So, without anything else, let's jump into the shooting. First round, we're going to be using Barnes Vortex 115 grain. They're all coppers. Hornady SSTs, these are 123 grain bullets. Wow. All right, Hornady ELDMs, these are 123 grain bullets as well. We're going to start out with 27.6 BLC2, 123 grain SSTs. 27.9 BLC2 28.2 BLC2 28.5 BLC2 BLC2. Thirty grains BLC2. Thirty grains BLC2. All right, back on the six five Grindle, twenty six point seven of Hargan. Not bad. All right, twenty seven grains of Hargan. Twenty-seven point six of Argus. Twenty-seven point nine of Argus. Twenty-eight point eight CFE. Six-five Grendel. Let's finish this up. Twenty-nine point one CFE. Whoa! Single whole group. Let's go. That was twenty-nine point one CFE two point three. Now I know, I know. I'm not necessarily a man of special treats, but this one's for you. I'm gonna include two days of shooting in this video, so we're gonna jump into day two. And I'll give you a fair warning. I think I was sick during this time. I was losing my voice. Who knows what I had? I didn't go to the doctor because I'm a man. The audio is kind of weird. You also hear my rifle cool at one part of this. So we're gonna skip through some of this. There are a handful of charges that I shot that just didn't turn out anything. So I've cut some of that stuff out. If you wanna hear more about those, I'm happy to include those later on. Uh, so drop that down in the comments. But special treat for you. My only request is that you click the like button, that you click the share button, and that you subscribe. I think this is CFE 223, uh, and it's 28.9 grades. There we go. Your arm is connected, bottom left target, top left bolt. Average was 23.16 with those five. 29 grains of CFE. I think our best groups out of this particular round were 29.1. Second bullet from the left on that top or bottom left target. Excuse me. I threw one high that time because my trigger broke. So that's on me. But our average on that was 23.52, so not bad. This particular charge was our most accurate charge last time, 29.1 grains. Twenty-three forty-seven average on that one. 
in terms of groups, that wasn't a super pretty group. Shots did group decently. That might be the group. That was 29.2 FCFE 223. Average 23.49.9. Next, we're going to shoot 29.3 of CFE 223. So, last time we shot this rifle, we did a lot of shooting in terms of uh, like making big, like three tenths of a grain uh, jumps. This time, we're working on much smaller jumps. The goal with this particular round is I want to have a really, really lethal hunting round. Spike in the velocity there at 2370. So this is 29.4 of CFE 223. This is the last one. 29.4 CFE 223. So what you saw at the beginning of the video was a little bit of foreshadowing to what happens next here. All right, so what you saw at the beginning of the video was what we call in the business a little bit of foreshadowing. If you're a hand loader, you probably saw that coming when you saw me get that box out. I just dumped all the rounds out. And the real shame of it is the 26.6 grains of accurate 2460 that I shot there were a great group. Uh, so we probably missed out on quite a bit there. So more testing to come in the future. In fact, Lord willing, and it doesn't rain a bunch tomorrow, I'll get a range day. So anyway, Enjoy this next part of it. We're going to speed through some of it. I hope you enjoy the rest of this shooting. I'll catch you at the end of the video. This is 26.6 of 2460. Yeah, we're going to start it on the right second. All right, that might be our load. Uh, I did pull that first one. That's on me. All those other shots were good. All right, so here's how we're going to do this. So you got to see all of it. Some really interesting results there. I think we actually have some promising stuff. When I was going back through the video, I remembered that CFE 223 shot pretty well. But one thing that I didn't remember is that BLC2 shot very well in two different groups. It looks like we probably found a couple of nodes. So what I've done is I've gone back and loaded a couple of different groups of rounds from that area that I think might perform really well. We're gonna check velocities and find a really good hunting round for this 6.5 Grindle, but there's a lot of promising stuff here. So we've got some good stuff out of CFE 223. We got some great stuff out of BLC2. We found some interesting places within Varget, which I've heard from other people on the internet. Shocker, that Varget does really well for this load. We got some more testing to do is what I'm trying to say here. but. Hopefully we'll get a range day tomorrow. I hope you enjoyed this video. Like I asked, please click the subscribe button and the like button down below. Share this video with a friend who doesn't reload to make them ask really silly questions about why was the man so sad when he dumped all of his loads out on this tailgate. And yeah, I hope to see you back here for the third installment of shooting this 6.5 Grindle. So until next time, peace.